right now, county commissioners stick to their plans, saying they will be closing Portage Manor. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Melissa Stevens. And I'm Terry McFadden. It is the latest in an ongoing fight for the building's future. Our Monica Murphy has been following this story very closely and joins us live outside the county city building with more. Monica. Yeah, you know, uh, commissioners made the announcement at their meeting early this morning. Now, they did explore, though, other options before making this decision. As many of you know, Portage Manor is a living facility that houses individuals with disabilities and mental illnesses. Now, county commissioners announced back in February that they would begin the process of closing the building. While the building was set to close in the spring, they gave community members 60 days to come up with a plan to save it. So it's a decision as an elected official. You look at all the options and we've weighed them. Some people think we're mean and uncaring, which isn't even remotely true. We've looked for the things that are going to be better for the residents. When you take everything in, into consideration, it's the best for everybody that we're going to close this and find another place for people to go. And the county council guys will vote at their meeting next Tuesday. Back to you. All right, Monica Murphy with an update from the uh, County City Building in downtown South Bend. Monica, thank you.